hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is nelo Mweke, and i'm a youtuber based in abuja nigeria so this morning i'm going to be showing you guys my skincare morning routine how i have brought my skin to this level let me give you guys like a backstory i've been struggling with hyperpigmentation textured skin bumpy skin like i am dry skin and this routine has really helped me to bring my skin to where it is i'm non i am nowhere near where i want to be if you want to see that keep on washing okay i've gone ahead to wash my face the first thing i use is this face wash it is called um face wash milk extract is a korean um face wash i bought this face wash from my local store and i like this face wash because it's very moisturizing and it cleans your face very well and maintains your ph balance i told you guys that my skin is dry initially i was using dodo Oshu as my face wash god this was so bad for me because this is very drying even though it has um, some benefits like it reduces your hyperpigmentation but it, it leaves my face very dry and tight and crazy like as if it's cracking but whenever i stay using this this feels very creamy very moisturizing very hydrating like i don't feel anything on my skin and that's what i like about it is that it doesn't have any smell in it so this my face wash it contains um niacinamide which is one thing i love about it because you know niacinamide is very good for the skin so this is what i use in washing my face and i open it and then i put it on my hand because it has like a pasty a thicker consistency you need to rub, run it over water then you now foam it on your hand that is when it's going to foam it's not liquid then i use it all over my face and then wash my face so now i'm done washing my face i'll go ahead and use um this to clean my face i no longer use towel to clean my face because i cannot i will not lie i can't maintain the cleanliness of washing the towel every time i use it so i love this it's inexpensive this is this pack is 200 naira so i just take one of these and you know this and dry my face like that bit all over my face i don't like rub it on my face so when i finish it i proceed to my serums so for my morning routine the first thing i go in with is my niacinamide which is like a serum i love this niacinamide because it's very good for my skin and because i was struggling with like textured skin niacinamide helps to like unclog your pores and just give you a, an appearance of like a more um, smooth like milk butter like finish and then it helps to also like repair your skin it has a lot of benefits that i'm going to list on in the screen below so i love to use this i have these bumps on my face but using this consistently it has really helped me reduce the appearance of the textured and bumpy skin that i have and that is one thing i love about this new um, um niacinamide the one i'm using is from ordinary and niacinamide it has a thicker consistency so i just rub it all over my face to my neckline i'll just wait for like a minute or i'll fan my face until like this dries down so now my face has finished drying down the next thing i'm going to enter into is hydration i have a dry skin hydration is everything to me so i get a serum that has a hydrating effect and the one i'm using now is by dr rachel this vitamin c brightening anti-aging face face serum and it contains hyaluronic acid hyaluronic acid in it is higher than the vitamin c so this is very very good for you and it's very hydrating and this is it has a much watery consistency so i'll go ahead and rub this all over my face you see the way this one is applying and the way it's running on my face because it has a more watery consistency so i'll go ahead lightly and place it all over my skin this just like even two pumps the way i did now can go all over your face hyaluronic acid is very good because it has the, it has this um hydrating effect which will help to like um give your face a, a very young or like plump feeling and um, reduce the appearance of fine lines which is anti-aging and at the same time help in um, your skin 
um, repairing and regeneration if you have any form of like inflammation or acne whatever is going to help to like you know cure all of that that is one thing i love about hyaluronic acid so i'll go ahead and leave this as well for it to dry but as it's drying i also want to show you other options of hyaluronic acid that you can get another hyaluronic acid i'm going to be showing you is this vitamin is this one from disa and it also contains vitamin c but more of hyaluronic acid and it's also inexpensive it's on the affordable side these are on the affordable side i think i, I don't think any of this is up to like 3k or maybe three five tops these two so the next one i'll be showing you the next thing i'll be showing you that also serves as a hydrating option for me is this aloe vera serum you know that aloe vera is obviously a hundred percent like is filled with water it's very hydrating so this serum that is from i assume this is also a korean beauty brand if i'm not mistaken yeah yeah so i also use this as a hydrating um serum now i don't rub all of this at once if i'm using this i this will serve as my hydrating serum if i want to use this this is going to serve as my hydrating serum or this it's just that by the end of the week i know that these three has touched my face so guys the next thing i'll go ahead to do is to use my eye cream guys i'm sorry they took the light so i had to go and on the gen so if case like the sound has changed that's the reason so as i was saying i use this um eye cream and it's from goji um brand it has three in one function it suits your eye it also helps reduce dark circles and appearance of fine lining so like it's for anti-aging as well i love this because first of all it's very soft on the eye i don't like when i'm rubbing a product on my face and it's very heavy and that is why i like all these products i'm showing you none of them are heavy like when you rub it like when i rub this eye cream in each immediately what i feel is as if there is ac like just on ac on my face or as a fan that is very close to my face is very hydrating and i also noticed that my fine lines not my fine lines like my dark circles has like reduced to a whole lot and this doesn't have any smell that's also one thing i love about my skincare i don't like my skincare or my makeup products to like have a heavy smell that this at all they don't have any scent they are all scentless so the next step i'm going to go into is to moisturize my face and the moisturizing cream i use is this one by dr rachel and it contains um, hyaluronic acid it moisturizes your skin very well so it helps improve fine line and dull skin and i was battling with the dull skin so hyaluronic acid will help to give you that youthful glow whilst niacinamide is going to like help reduce the texture and all of that you know for your face to be looking plump and juicy i love this especially first of all it's inexpensive or rather it's as affordable yep and then it can even say i'm almost done with it it is very 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 light like water that's one thing i love about it like the way it's so watery and light I don't like when I rub a cream on my face, I can feel it sitting on my face. So I'm going to go ahead and take this and dab it all over my face. I stopped like rubbing my cream, my cream, my products this way. And I just dab it into my skin. I don't know that there is any difference, but not what I do. I'm just showing you guys what I do now. <laughs> and it's working for me. <laughs> so I'll bring it down to my neck. If there is anyone that is remaining i'll put it on my like rub it into my arms and this is what i use another very good um hydrating face cream that you can get is neutrogena their hydro boost is very good my sisters they use it and it's very very spectacular so the next thing we're going to be doing and this step is the most important because everything you have done here if you don't do this if you don't do this you are just like moving yourself backwards and it's spf and this spf i use is by misha and it's aqua spf 50 plus 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 i love this spf because first of all it's lightweight it has a bit of smell but the smell is not like it's very mild it's not like all over in your face so this is one i use it's also affordable somewhat affordable and i know that it's affordable for it 
not to be leaving white cars it's affordable and that's something i love about this, this uh, sunscreen my last vlog i told you guys about if you've not watched that vlog please watch it about all the product i bought that we have nonsense and i had two experience that are there that are like very bad but this is so good so i just go ahead and put like two strips on my hand here the way you are told to put your you know your sunscreen so once i do that i put it on my hands and then rub it together and then after rubbing this i'll just dab it into my skin guys just look at how this just melts into my skin and it doesn't leave any white cards you don't have to wait for 10 minutes and i was telling you guys that this thing has a smell but the smell is so minute like it's got my nose it's sensitive it's so you can't even perceive nothing and look at your face it's not giving you that um you're not looking like overly oily like you are looking like you're glowing like do you get it's so beautiful guys i love 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 this spf and the spf that is very good for you as a black girl that doesn't leave white cast is black girl sunscreen i'm going to put it in the screen here it is very good i've used it because my sister that's the sunscreen my sister is and i've used it before and that one i know that it's very good is um, la roche i mean that's how they pronounce it la roche bar is this new brand that is, is like the rave is everywhere and i've seen people that use it and it's very good on your face i love this extra because it's hydrating again because my skin care sorry my skin is very dry anything i'm using on my face i love to make sure that it has hydrating benefits i don't want anything that is mattifying on my face i don't want i don't want it on my skincare i want water flood me with water guys i just realized that i didn't tone my face once I made after washing my face, I went straight into using my serum. So let me explain this step for you guys. I am so sorry about that. You are going to go in and use your toner after washing your face. The toner I have here is this Neutrogena 2 in 1 toner. It helps to fight and uh, fight acne and reduce the appearance of post acne marks. We, in essence, it's going to help to. Um, fight hyperpigmentation now for this toner i love to use it at night the reason being that it contains aha aha is an exfoliating acid and exfoliating acid helps to reduce like the depigmentation remove dry skin that is on your face so that the new skin can come out and because of this it makes your skin sensitive to the sun so i love to use this at night but even if you use it at during the day i would advise you to go ahead and use um it's not an advice it's a must use your spf so i love to use this at night however during the day i love to use this simple um toner it doesn't contain any alcohol so it's very mild on my face it's very um hydrating it doesn't strip off i don't feel like it's stripping off anything from my face i don't feel any kind of tingly sensation and all of that i remember that because i wash my face thoroughly my toning process does not serve as a cleaning medium so meaning that by the time i clean my face with my cotton wool there is no dirty marks on it so i just go ahead and rub this on my face and i then move to my serum i go ahead and use vaseline as my lip balm i like this because it's very thick on your lips so when you rub it instantly it moisturizes your lips it removes the softens the dead skin and it, they fall off instantly like i love it i love everything about it and this is the one i'm using this vaseline the original one i also have this one that contains um cocoa butter so any one that you have it's very okay i used to have the one that has the aloe vera but i don't have it anymore so these are the steps for my morning routine and i've gotten my skin this far if you found this video helpful please thumbs up this video i'll see you guys in my next one bye bye